It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joey. Today we're going to be taking a look at the exclusive Lucador infected unit. Now this is a really cool unit that they gave out at PAX East as well as to all the beta players that played World Domination. Now it's a really cool unit, I'm not going to lie, I really like how it looks and we're going to actually go ahead and redeem it live here and then we're going to go into some gameplay with and see how it kind of shapes up to be and kind of what the stats and all that jazz are. So let me go ahead and pull up the redeem section here. Now let's go ahead and get the code up here. Now I'm going to actually blur this out so you aren't even going to be able to see it sadly enough. But Lucador code, let me go ahead and put this bad boy in. It's going to take a second. I'm going to speed it up maybe. <clears throat> All right, guys, so we have successfully redeemed the code. Had to kind of speed that up a little bit because it was taking a while. Actually, it was on the survivors. Need to be on the infected. Long story short, we got it. We redeemed the code. So let's go ahead and push OK. And let's pull up the team and throw this bad boy into our team. Now, I actually am on my lower level zombie account that's connected to my lower level uh, survivor account. So I haven't played with this one too much, but we do have a solid little group here. Let me go ahead and change my team up here. I'm going to swap out this, take out the one spitter there, leave the defiler, and throw in Lucador. There he is. What a beast. Let's accept that. Take a look at him. Look at him. Beautifully designed. I love the view hue. I like his little yellow cape. He kind of looks like a, I guess he was, is resembling a Mexican wrestler or something like that. That kind of thing. It looks really cool. I love how it looks. I don't Beautifully designed. So let's go ahead and check out some of these stats on him. See what he's got. So he is a rare unit. Flying off the top rope, the Lucador forces his opponents to tap out high health, medium damage unit, a great damage sponge for your front line. So he's really good meat shield, great tank unit to use. Um, let's see, ranged units will tear him up. So of course, you always have to watch out for those snipers when using big brute, brute units like this. But if you're going up against, say, mercenaries, guns, Flingers, scatter shots, gunfighters, things like that. Maybe even a firefighter. They're gonna have. He's gonna do pretty well. But if you look at those snipers, it's gonna be a pretty tough situation, especially with that bushwick. The other exclusive I'm gonna show in another video, but that's gonna also be a very interesting setup. So I mean, nothing too crazy, nothing too differentiated from a normal brute. But let me go ahead and check out the stat difference here. So I have the Lucador health. He's at 120, and then compared to my level two Colossus, which is 272. So and it's sort of comparable, but um, yeah, he is a just going to be a solid brute unit to have. He looks like a beast, so it's really fun to have on your team when you have a really well-designed unit here. So let me go ahead and check out the perks really here. Um, looks like it's um, fairly similar to the brutes, um, if I see correctly. However, there is a different one right here. We have the angry flailing taunts humans to attack. That's all it really is. It's very similar to the um, firefighters or the fire chief's perk where he will actually do the very same thing, taunting the other units. So let's go ahead and get some gameplay in here really quick to uh, go ahead and wrap up this video. Let's go ahead and check out, let's go ahead and continue the campaign. I'm excited to see how this um, plays out in the gameplay here. So let's go ahead and fight. Uh, feeling pretty good about it. Uh, yeah, there we go. Loading it up here, New Orleans. It ain't easy being big, guys. So I'm really looking forward to actually giving this a shot. Um, if you actually have a Lucador, go ahead and throw it in the comment section and tell me how he is working for you guys. But I'm pretty excited to get after it with him. Because I have not gotten a chance to play with him yet. I haven't redeemed him on my main zombies account yet either. Alright, so what do we have here? So right up front we have a large group of snipers which will pretty much demolish him. That's what we have to look out for mainly. Now there's also some, let's see, let's go ahead and kind of check out the rest here. So these gunfighters, he would actually do very well against these gunfighters on this right side here. However, we will see. Now where do I want to start this off? So I'm going to actually, hmm... Where do I want to start off here? I'm going to start off a solid group, a little, uh, solid little small group here. Let me go ahead and also start a group over here to work on taking out these snipers here. Take out a delivery man. Take out some of those snipers. We're going to start working our way towards them. Gunfire is just tearing them up. Not what I like to see. Lucador is going to go head up out front with Dr. Zomboy. So we got to zoom in on the gameplay here. There Lucador goes. He is just soaking up damage. As you can see, that sweet animation where he just kind of bulks up there, does a little body slam. I actually really like that. That's actually pretty cool. But there they go. They take out, they manage to take out that guy right there. I'm going to throw down the rest of my drones and an infector so we can start getting some bonus units here. Let me go ahead and start throwing out. I don't want to throw you down yet. 
I'm going to throw down a runner and a spitter. And then let's throw another Colossus up here to take more damage. Soak him up. Stim him up. And that will give us a little extra boost to take out that machine gunner there. And we're going to be heading on our way towards the next objectives. Now, we do have another Lucador already up. So I'm going to go ahead and throw him right up front so we can start taking some damage from those gunfighters. Now, he is, as you can see, taking up quite a bit of damage. However, with his lower level, he's not going to be as resilient as compared as we like him just because he is level one but he's still pretty much from what you guys seen here he's very strong in terms of i don't know for level one i mean that's pretty impressive i think he's going up against i don't really know what level these guys are com compared to but i mean still he's putting up a really solid fight here i'm gonna go ahead and throw up a delivery man go ahead and get ahead of the game here throw down another infector they're gonna start working on that firefighter there it looks like we have another machine gunner just hanging out back there I don't like that. I'm going to throw up two more tank units, guys. And that will most likely conclude it. We're just going to have to finish off this one objective point, and that will complete it. So the Lucador has pretty much proven himself to be an absolutely phenomenal tanky unit. I can't wait to get him leveled up and stuff like that, guys. I hope you did enjoy this brief gameplay with him. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited to get him a little bit more use out of him. But guys, I do hope you enjoyed this exclusive Lucador gameplay. I'm actually going to get one more quick attack in really brief and I'm going to fast forward to it and we'll be right back with that and it'll be quick. I just want to get a couple more like zoom ins on that sweet animation. So let's go ahead and uh, fast forward to that. All right, guys, so we're back here. I'm going to go ahead and start this off really quick. Let me go ahead and throw down a couple drones, throw down Lucador right up front here, get some more guys, and as you can see, we're going to zoom in as close as we can. There he is. Does that little body slam, arm, elbow, just kind of like pop. Pretty sweet. I'm kind of liking the animation here. As you can see, he's really barely holding on, but he soaked up a ton of that damage, keeping a bulk of my drones alive. Let me go ahead and throw him down. Where is this machine gunner all set up? All right, so once we get through this, I'm going to go ahead and set a delivery man runner right up the bat here just so we can go ahead and work on taking out these guys. Let me throw ahead another Lucador just to get a ton of meat shield just so we can take out the machine gunner and ensure uh, the least amount of losses towards our guys here. So as you can see, that machine gunner is not playing nice. He is not being the best friend we need right now because... Ugh, not too good, but we did manage to break through that wall just in time. Take him out. We're going to flank him on both sides here. Did not stand a chance. Let me go ahead and throw down the rest of my guys here. I'm going to go ahead and sacrifice these guys just to break through this wall. Eh, didn't really need it, but hey, why not? Let me go ahead and just throw down the rest of my units. Looks like we're going to have a pretty easy win for the remainder of this attack, guys. But yeah, that is the Lucador. Really cool unit. I love those animations. Really cool. But yeah, but guys, I hope you really did enjoy this. Can't wait to show you more gameplay of the Bushwick unit, which will be coming up next, which is the Sniper Survivor unit. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed this exclusive Lucador gameplay. But yeah, guys, I uh, thank you so much for watching as always, and I will see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.